<laughs> okay, this is a pretty simplistic question. What's your name first? Dan. Dan, yeah. nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you too. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, um, I'm a brand new eBay seller. I've only sold a few things on eBay. You got the right book. So <laughs> this should be a big help to me, but I haven't read it yet. And one of the questions that I see high cost, moderate cost, and very low cost items on eBay, what would you say would be um, a reasonable um, profit margin for you to make if you were to, you know, what's the lowest cost item that you would put on Work there? the numbers. I happen to sell an item very profitably that mm -hmm. sells for under $8. I know what my fees are, mm -hmm. I know what it costs me. The more I buy from the manufacturer, the cheaper it is, right? right? Mm -hmm. So even if I just make, I call it, it's Marsha's theory of fast quarters versus slow dollars. Mm -hmm. I'd rather have those quarters coming out like a slot machine, yeah. really, right. than be waiting around for the dollars. Right. So you've got to think, so. if, if you can live with that, I mean, that's kind of nice. It's that cash flow going on. So I have some very cheap items that happen to sell well. And then you can also mix that in with some more expensive items. Volume on the low price items and, the, and then add some higher prices. Exactly, price. exactly. Right. Okay. And don't go deep, don't invest a lot of money in the beginning. Find an item, get one, test it out. Your cost will probably be a little higher if you're only buying one from a distributor. Right. But see how it goes on eBay. Do some research, see if other mm -hmm. people are selling it and see what they're getting for that item. In the completed listings. In right. the completed okay. listing search. Right. That's okay. the best way to do it. All right. Hope that helps. Thank you. Thank <laughs> right. you.